Well, I started 28 years ago, and I actually got started when I was in college. I didn't have any money, and I was uh, trying to graduate in architecture and in finance. And I bought an old pickup for like $600, and it smoked like crazy. And I used to go out and just do concrete repairs in that. And that's basically how I got started, worked in the, my, my bedroom. It's like going into a big giant whirlwind, and before you can solve that problem, another one comes at you. And then while you're looking at that one, another one comes from another side. And you know, if it's not employee issues, you have you know customers you have to make happy, financial issues you need to worry about. You know, you have logistics, you have repairs, you have mechanical equipment that uh, needs to be fixed, and it all happens you know in real time, all at the same time. And, and you know, those are all challenges that you have to overcome. The big thing about our company and my philosophy is that we want to make sure that customers are treated accurately, objectively, and fairly. In, in our industry, sometimes the diagnosis of foundation problems is done by people that are not engineers. We have an engineering staff guided by a licensed civil engineer who goes out and, and analyzes problems objectively, fairly, and using consensus industry standards. For us, our whole company is all about making sure that the customer is getting something that's going to benefit them, not just benefit us. That's not what we believe in. It really does matter how you treat the customer. It really does matter that you try to look after their best interests by being objective and fair and, and making sure that they're having a, a benefit and, 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 a, and a great experience by dealing with us, not just a place where we can build our company and, 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 and make money and those kinds of things.